Why in the world would anyone choose SMMA over dropshipping? Maybe because they're a genius. Nah, for real, but um, look, man. In 2022, why I choose SMMA over dropshipping? So, first of all, bro, I know y'all see it right now, bro. Dropshipping is going dummy. E-commerce is going dumb on the tube. Like, it's going stupid, bro. Everybody is trying to drop shipping. Everybody want to get a little website, connect their AliExpress store, and ship. Start selling their uh, they product with them one month shipping times. Yeah, let's get it. One month shipping times. But, dog, no. It ain't going to work, bro. Drop shipping seems like it's becoming really saturated. And it's not like it's oversaturated because you know the big dogs can always win bro you can always find a way to do something if you really want to do it for example like i could really dedicate my my time and the next week i'm just tripping in a week that's not <laughs> the next three months to fully investing in drop shipping and trying to get it work and maybe even a year but eventually work but now it's not the best business model for me i tried it and you know you can't say from a perspective of you tried it and you didn't really go in because you're not you know that's why you're not successful because i took my time and i set up everything as perfect as i could link cj drop shipping i got the a product that i feel like was doing well but wasn't too oversaturated and i tried to get good ads the one thing I did mess up on, I didn't have my own ads, but besides the point, bro, I had my first product in the first week that I actually tried, and I did have a budget um, of a thousand, but you're gonna have a budget if you don't wanna start out slow unless you try TikTok organic or something like that, but I got $500 in revenue. So, I mean, it's nothing to brag about by any means at all. Like, that's completely trash, bro. People get 500 in like 30 minutes or a day. But for somebody that's starting off, most people, they struggle a lot to get off the ground. So I feel like having tried it and having ran my ass and really seeing the inside of the business, it's not my ideal business, bro. But SMMA is, and I'm gonna get into it, why? Because for SMMA, for somebody like me, well, for anybody, like anybody, you don't need money to get started. SMMA is it's a social media marketing agency. So all you need to do is go to a business that has problems and solve them for them. So basically you're the man that's supplying services to the business rather than to the customers. And it's more safer than drop shipping, in my opinion, because if you really get good at it and can make it work, then you'll never be out of it. Because as long as we have businesses, they're gonna have problems that they need fixed. You know, and as long as we have people in the world that buy stuff, we're gonna have businesses. So people was right when they said, if you learn marketing and you learn sales, then you really, you know, you'll be set for life. And See, the thing about SMMA, though, is a few character traits that you need to be good at to, in order to, to uh, actually be successful. You need to be a social person. You need to be pretty confident and talking to people because in order to get your clients and, let's say, rent ad, different services you can do for the marketing agency. But for me, I'm going to do paid ads. I'm going to do Facebook ads for them. So let's say I want to run Facebook ads for them. I got to actually do the outreach and text so many number of business owners hey 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 you want to do like you need help you uh do you want more customers you want more leads yada 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 and then they say yeah and then i you know get, get on the call with them and i gotta let y'all i gotta let them know why my services are adequate or even excellent enough performing for them to go with me so you can't get on the phone and the car's all scared and you know expecting them to go with your services because if you're not confident in your services, why would they? So definitely you gotta work on your people skills. And I feel like that's something I'm pretty good at is people and talking to them 
and uh, drop shipping is like you behind a computer, bro. And sometimes it's like you never even left the rat race. So we get in these jobs and we try to be entrepreneurs. And uh, we say, oh, I'm gonna do this business because I don't have to work for nobody. And then you get into something like that and you're trying to figure it out. And it's like you slaving away, you putting all those hours away and nothing's turning over for you. It's just like, bro, or you just got to keep doing it because the product dies fast, you get a lot of sales, and then you got to be on to the next one in like a year, 18 months. But SMMA, bro, it's just over time, you build up more clients, let's say two to three clients a month at 2,500, maybe. And so in your first three months, sign a client for 2,500, 5,000, 7,500, almost 10,000, bro, a month. And it's like, it's all local businesses in the area that, that have like no ads up, no marketing. And you can just help them out, bro. And it benefits everybody. It benefits the business because they grow. It benefits you because you get paid and it benefits the customer because likely you have a lot of good offers and good deals that come from this type of thing when you start um, scale up and get there, get more, uh, just get more exposure. So that's why I feel like it's perfect. And I feel like it's a hidden gem because again, you type dropshipping on YouTube right now, millions of videos posted in like the last day, last week, last hour. But SMA, you type that in and yeah, people know about it, but it's only a, really like a few that's really taking over and dominating this space. So I feel like there's a lot of space for a new person on YouTube to come up in the game and grow in the SMA space. And that's going to be me, bro. I'm taking that talent zone. Um, it's like, I don't know, bro. Honestly, I'm, I'm geeked for it, bro. I'm really uh, excited to see how the SMA journey is gonna go. I'm really um, trying to get my first client in August. Everything, you know, preventing, I got everything in order, all my cars lined up. Uh, my salesperson, or my contractor that's finna run my ads for me and uh, help me help my clients. It shouldn't take more than a month or two months. It shouldn't take more than at least two months to sign my first client, at least, bro try to get them on and then that's another thing it's a month so at least you get like three months of a contract when they come on unless something is like terribly atrocious and you just cannot get no results for them at all you know they'll work with you and so you sign them on you be like look i'm gonna do i'm starting out um so i do 1500 a month for three months they pay you you already know you locked in for the next two months all you got to do is provide them with great results and then you go ahead and get another client and another client. And it sounds easy, but it's not, I promise you. And I already know that. Dropship wasn't easy, but I got results with that. So, you know what I'm saying? You just gotta know your person in this world of business, man. Don't be trying to do what everybody else doing, bro. You gotta make sure you make the right decision for you because when all these e-commerce businesses coming in and they working in the business trying to find the next product, who gonna be making money? The marketing agencies that's solving the pro the problems for them are not having enough time to market, not having um, good enough marketing because they can't focus on it as well as all these other areas. Same thing. So we have one job to specialize in marketing and getting results for our clients, bro. And honestly, I'm excited to start having on sales calls and talking to people, bro. Just connecting and seeing, you know, really sharpening up that skill. So. That's why I feel like, you know, it, it, SMMA is the best business model for me. I ain't gonna say it's the best because if you're not a people person or if you don't like managing a business from the outside and not working in it, it's not the best for you. So that's really what it, what I came with here to let y'all know today. And that's going to be kind of the direction of my, my content and my channel will be going in SMMA. And, uh, Shout out to Iman Gaji, bro, for him putting this content out. Because if you wanted to put stuff like this out and really made the, the uh, remote revolution video, I would have never found out about this um, or really been as convinced as I, I was to actually start. I already knew about it. But my plan was to start dropshipping and then SMMA. 
once I learn the marketing. But finding out, you don't need to be a master at marketing to start, bro. Cause you can you can get a, get you a contractor and work with them and still provide value for your clients. And it's like he always says this is an unsexy business model. It's not a good. It, it, it's not really cool. But I don't give a dog. I don't care, bro. <laughs> About no business. I like it, bro. I think it's pretty cool, honestly. I like I like the vibes in, in SMMA, bro. I see SMMA people come on, bro. They got their button on shirt, a little necklace, bro, a little fit on. You know what I'm saying? They real clean, classy, bro. I like that. And I think that's my crowd, so you know what I'm saying? I'm ready. Let's get it, y'all. 2022 SMMA, we going up, man. Stay tuned for the journey. Let's get it.